Hi, I'm A1 Serious, and I would like to take this moment to present my channel to you. In my channel, I have several sections, and four of them are basically playlists. And that's the absolute beginners, the accomplished beginners, and the Blender 2.6 topics, and the Blender 2.6 lighting and presentation playlists. And then you have the popular uploads, recent, and the, the playlists section, if you want to view all the playlists. Uh, and my channel is all about learning Blender as quickly as possible for the absolute beginner. So if we look at this absolute beginner playlist, it's intended to you work through it from one and on to how far you want to go. But uh, at eight and nine, that's the first time when you have the opportunity to actually uh, create a model. And then there's a, c a couple of uh, animation tutorials and the materials, and then there's a, a small project that is a four-part project that you can go through. And then there, there are some uh, Bezier curve uh, tutorials, some more materials, and some rendering. And I should say that there is an updated version for tutorial 8 and 9 for Blender 2.6 and forward. And the, this should get you started. And if you to get some exercise to work through, you know, to actually solidify that skill set, you can keep working with the accomplished beginners Blender t tutorials. They're not as sequential; you can do it, you know, in a, in any order uh, as such. But um, one of my thoughts is that if you do the tutorials, then you'll have the files, the materials, so that you can complete more of it later. For instance, uh, when you get to some of the lighting uh, and presentation, then there's, um, you can play that right here. There's a um, tutorial on using the sun as a light source, and uh, there's a sunset scenario that is um, Go, uh, that we go through and this is something that if you have you know done the how, little house tutorial and a little car tutorial and a little man tutorial then you know you know how to create all these things and you can you know do all this you know for yourself if you like to uh, of course it's not necessary you can just follow through on the tutorial but this way that's my idea throughout that there's nothing secret nothing that you if you follow through these tutorials, you should have all the skills and the abilities to actually do what I'm talking about. So that that is my one of my basic points is to try to to introduce you to concepts that allows you to move forward in your uh, building your skill set. And one of those skills are using particle systems. So that's kind of a fun part or here we're using a particle particle system to create hair and you can see one of the uh, of the errors is that um, we don't have collision here with the object so the hair you know pokes through the actual object but um, that's because uh, at that time blender didn't have hair collision turned on for for objects uh, and there's also a, a couple of um, uh, you know, with the light and presentation playlist. Look at that real quick here. Uh, there are lights and there's also background tutorials and I would like to play uh, those just real right here. This is about, you know, your light rigs and um, how you can uh, put things in focus through light and uh, you know what light means to your render for reasons of the unknown then those my i think it's my video card is stumbling on this i have too many processes running at the same time so i'll just quit that and uh, then we have also something about background using an image as a background here you can see when you're using a paper image it looks kind of funny right because the sky is still and the earth is moving so the way to do that is to do the real real background but you'll learn more about that later if you care to view the tutorials and there's the little car again
And here's just a view of um, one of the uh, Blender files. This is the one where you create the car, uh, and uh, it covers, you know, modeling uh, and a little bit about materials. But that's basically it for this. And my idea with all of these is that this should allow you the quickest possible access to Blender. Uh, and uh, also, if you're a little bit more accomplished Blender user, the Blender topics are are you know intended for if you need to brush up on something and just pick something up real quick. Um, uh, there's depth of field and um, rigging, text, some animated text, and uh, uh, node materials. And that's a, a, a playlist that keeps growing. And the, if you have questions, I try to answer as soon as I can, as soon as my day job allows me. So um, I hope you will enjoy learning Blender. That's my intent. Uh, I will hope to hear from you, and um, I thank you for your time.